Welcome to Let's Do Science with Mr. Musset and Sons. Hello, I'm Mr. Musset. And I'm And I'm Malachi. Today is a very special edition. And oh, that's right, we've been doing it all week, we've been experimenting with water. And today is no different, it's been the last one with water this week, we're going to move on to different things next week. But let me say before we started, if you're experimenting with water, make sure you've got an adult's permission. If you're on water, like we are today with a paddling pool and a big amount of water, make sure you've got adult supervision and somebody knows where you are at all times. So today, as promised, we've been playing again with floating and sinking and we're looking at making a Zechariah sized boat. <coughs> Now to do this we need to make something that's going to displace more water so that it floats. So Malachi is on his kayak ready and you can see it's already he's displacing enough water that when he's in it, it's still floating. Mm -hmm. Right, so why don't you check out what we've been up to and we'll join you back here in a, in a few moments and we'll show you and we'll work out whether our boat is going to float or sink. Welcome back. Right, I hope you enjoyed watching us make our boat. So I lean over here. Here it is. The first thing we're going to do, I'm just going to push Malachi away. The first thing we've got to do is see if it floats first before we even put Zechariah right in it. What do you reckon? Do you reckon it's going to float? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Here we go. Malachi's on standby. Zechariah, mm. spread your body weight out. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> It's a Zechariah sized boat. <laughs> wow. Now I am my own boat. Do you want to use my own? I'll have a go with yours, Zeki. Now uh, you can see it's a little bit wobbly from side to side. That's because most of the boat is sitting up on top of the water. We did talk about building the hole deeper down so it would sit lower or putting something up to steady it. But we decided we would go for this because we've waterproofed it with black sacks and it was a bit complicated if we did anything different but whoa see what i mean by being a bit uneven what we could do is later on this is how we do with experiments if we put a, a rudder down on the bottom to hold it it would help it from tipping over and keep it more stable right so we might go round and we might play with that and improve it because this is what we do when we do science no go for me right shall we shall we by magic <laughs> Shall we by magic, oh, stay no, there, no, stay no. there. Shall we by magic swap over <laughs> and see if it'll hold Malachi? Yeah. Ready? Three, two, one, go. And here we are, look, Malachi is floating. He needs to adjust his body weight a little bit because it's gonna tip. So adjust your body weight. I've got you, you're not going anywhere. Right. So if he gets himself, that's it, he's low, central gravity down a bit, you need to lean forward a bit more. Move to the middle of the boat. Right, stay still. Zeki, watch. Look at this. Look. No hands. No hands. How amazing <laughs> is that? That is fantastic. The boat works. Yes! Look at that. <laughs> now, I've got one more thing we're going to try and show you. As if by magic we're going to get prepped. So, we'll okay. see you in a second. Yes. Hello and welcome back. Just to prove our boat works, as if by magic we've got Jura, our dog, with us. Now he doesn't like water, but because he's a he's a cross with a French bulldog and an old English bulldog, he's actually not very good at swimming. So if he if he if he falls in, he's going to sink. But he is proving that the boat works. Right, we're going to finish our our video on floating and sinking in water. Next week we're going to do some things with marbles, hopefully, and some physics. We'd love to see you join us. Please comment below. Let us know what you've been up to. No, right, no. And you'll have seen our boat work. So good, good luck. So it's goodbye from me. It's goodbye, goodbye from me. me. Excellent. See you later. Bye-bye.